What's up, YouTube? Tenchi Arizona, the angry Dracolope of the Jackalope crew here. And this video is for the cigar smokers among us. And it is going to be a review of this, the Calibri V-Cut Cigar Cutter. And honestly, there's not much I can say about this in terms of a review. The build quality is outstanding. Customer service on part of Calibri is outstanding. Blade sharpness, very good. I wouldn't say outstanding because there probably are sharper cutters out there at higher price brackets. But in the price bracket of this one, very, very nice. Mine is the blue and black. It is available in other colors. And quite honestly, prior to using this cutter, I was using a cheap Chinese one, which I have here. This cheap Chinese one has got a bit of a, a wire wrap there, just to improve comfort, because it was cutting into my finger on that side when I was using it. Don't use this anymore though. I also used to use a cigar punch before I got this cutter. So, what do I have to say about this cutter that makes this a review? Well, the price of this cutter is not too shabby actually. I think I paid around £30 for it several months ago. I can't remember, but the person I actually bought it off will be able to correct me on that if I am wrong. So, what do I think of the build quality of this cutter? Well, it is entirely metal. There is not a bit of plastic on this cutter, except maybe the button. In fact, even the button might be metal. It is assembled with four torque screws, oh, sorry, eight torque screws, four per side. So if you need to take it apart, that is, doable though personally i would not recommend it because the blades on these never need to be taken out to be sharpened in fact in the time i've had this i've smoked probably 20 or 30 cigars all cut with this cutter and it's still as the sh as sharp as the day i got it ergonomics it is very very comfortable to use and quite honestly yeah you can see that it is easy to use one-handed which all cigar cutters should be in my opinion unless they're tabletop cutters again it is a calibri a well-known brand which i believe actually means hummingbird in italian but yeah i really do like this cutter as I said, the blade is of outstanding quality. I've never had to sharpen it. I do like the fact it's also spring-loaded. So quick and easy to cut. You don't have to worry about it opening in your pocket. Literally, it cannot open like that. You have to depress the switch for it to open. So that is a plus. Unlike cheap Chineseium, yeah. That's not good. You don't want these sort of things opening in your pocket because you can get cut that way. So, for des design, first off, design five stars. Now, personally, I would have preferred the red and black, but I do really like how the blue and black looks. We all know red and black are my favorite colors, without a doubt. But the blue and black really, really does pop. Again, if it, if it doesn't show up well on the camera, I'll insert an image up here. Should do because I have got my recording light on. But yeah, design, visual design, five stars, ergonomics. It is extremely comfortable to use, five stars. Price, five stars, basically. Uh, blade sharpness, well, I'll be honest with you, blade sharpness is definitely five stars. As the first day I had this, I decided to uh, run my thumb across the blade to see how sharp it was. And I actually cut my thumb open on it. <laughs> so, yeah, that was kind of funny, actually. 
but yeah, completely a five star rated cigar cutter. Pretty much all I can say on it. So that's all I am going to say. I highly recommend it. End of story. But in addition, I've also done a video on the Calibri Falcon lighter. This lighter, which is what I pair my cutter with. As you can see, they are both Calibris. And yeah, I have these two together at all times. I usually have both on me. So, and both are five star rated. Anyway, that's all for the review. But if you want to support my channel, I do have at the moment 160 channel stickers. These are going for a dollar fifty a piece. And if you want to get yourself some, you'll find a PayPal.me link in the description of my videos and in my channel banner. Anything from the sales of these stickers goes back into the channel. That's pretty much all I can say on that. They are 70 by 70 stickers, by the way. And they are also vinyl, so suitable for outdoor use, such as on tackle boxes, toolboxes, or gun cases. Anyway, that's all for now. If you like it, like it, please subscribe, comment, and share. And remember, be good to each other.